The original interest was to make a feature film out of it, uh, but uh, I always felt like, oh, just the scripts always felt like too much was cut. That was my whole pitch to Tony was, I don't want to figure out what to cut out of your book to make it fit in a movie. I want to take your book, adapt it much more faithfully than that, and put it on screen. Ladies and gentlemen. Before I begin my broadcast today, I have something to say. The whole project was a humanist project to try to say, look, there's young people, really, really young people being indoctrinated, being told absolute lies, anti-Semitic stories. You know, the story of radio, the penetration of radios into these German homes. Goebbels, this awful guy, the propaganda minister, had this goal of trying to get, I think it was seven million new radios, these inexpensive radios that the state were sponsoring, incapable of shortwave, only marked for German stations, seven million into German kitchens by 1939. And he did it, he achieved it. When I was a child, I was trained to look at radio frequencies. The things that I've seen haunt me. You are going to find her, and you will kill this girl yourself. I love this book, and I wanted to do right by the book in an authentic way. And so I did a global search that was open to low vision and blind contenders. And I ended up finding an eight-year-old and a 20-something, Aria being the 20-something who was a Fulbright scholar, PhD student who'd never, not only hadn't she acted before, she's never auditioned before, but it was clear that she had a fierce intelligence and a soulful quality that I could work with. All the people of the world have become evil at the same time. She worked her tail off to craft a performance that I think is one for the ages. Darkness lasts, Darkness lasts not, not even, even for one me. second. When you turn on the light, I know that broadcasting could get me executed. But I will not be silenced. I hope you will tune in again tomorrow. The big risk of the book and in the show is to see, can a viewer empathize as much with Marie, this resistance fighter who we're kind of used to cheering for, as much with her as with Werner, this boy who swept up into the machine of the German light. And, and it really is about shining a light on the nuance of people, right? That you are not your descriptor. And to just, once again, show the nuance and the complexity of an experience. That it's not only the thing you assume. The most important light is the light you cannot see.